first thing we're gonna do is actually mount a two by three print. This is the standard operation of this table. Doesn't matter if I'm mounting large boards, small boards, if I'm mounting laminate, if I'm mounting laminate directly to print vinyl. Um, this is the standard technique. So the first thing we're gonna do is always, you know, make sure we've got a good clean substrate. Now I've pre-cut a two by three board here. You don't have to pre-cut, okay? This can actually be run over the edge with bleed. Um, it can be done smaller like what we're doing right here. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna line our graphic up. We're gonna drop the roller down, okay? Once that graphic is in place, it's not gonna move, which is gonna allow us to hold it edge to edge. If we need to hold a straight line, for, for nine, 10 feet, we can do that. Once I drop that roller down, my substrate won't move and my graphic won't move. So I've got the roller dropped down and come back to about two o'clock on the roller. I'm actually gonna start peeling the backer back. I use my right hand and touching that adhesive as little as possible. Use my right hand to hold the vinyl and my left hand will fold the flap of the paper backer underneath. We're just gonna roll it right over. Come right back on. I'm gonna make sure I don't get into the crease where I started. Take my vinyl over. I'm gonna grab my flap, pull that paper backer, give myself plenty of space. If we allow the paper backer to get into the roller, that's when we can cause wrinkles. So we're gonna keep that paper backer as far back as we can. and we've just mounted a two by three sign. 